Hey everybody and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to show you how to get Microsoft Planner on desktop. Let's begin. To use Microsoft Planner on your desktop, you can access it through a few different methods. As of the moment, it is not available as a standalone desktop application. Now, you want to make sure that you go to your preferred web browser if you're using google chrome brave safari microsoft edge and just go to tasks.office.com and from here you would be able to see the welcome microsoft planner interface all you have to do is sign in with your microsoft 365 or office 365 account the one that is linked to your organization or personal subscription click the sign in you see you also have an option to get planner for ios or get the planner for android but not on desktop right click on sign in and from here you can pick an account i'm going to be using this one right here you see if you encounter any problems such as this one but you want to make sure that you have an access to the microsoft planner especially if the microsoft planner is part of your organization all right now if you wanted to create a new account all you're going to do is go here Click the try it free option and just follow the on screen instructions. All right. Once you have successfully logged in, you will be able to open the Microsoft Planner on your desktop via a web browser. All right. So that's one way. Another option is if you're using Microsoft Teams, all right, open that, go to the app section and look for the Microsoft Planner. Obviously, if the Microsoft Teams is installed in your desktop, you would be able to open the Microsoft Planner straightly from there. You see this option right here? That's the Microsoft Planner. Click on open. You see you have two options. You can use on your own or use with others. All right. And click on this button right here. What will happen is you would be forwarded to the same interface earlier. Just go to the left side panel of your dashboard. Click the My Plans. This is going to be the Planner Hub and click the task that you wanted from here you can add more tasks as you go along the way add a task and a lot more all right basically that's how you get your microsoft planner on desktop although we are using the web browser you can also open it to microsoft edge safari or any kind of browser that supports microsoft planner you want to make sure it's compatible and by accessing it through uh integrating it with other Microsoft Teams, um, syncing with Outlook Task, or installing it as a progressive web app or PWA on your desktop. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.